Happening now, kids living with di type 1 diabetes specifically are spending the week at a camp in Schoolcraft County. TV6's Tristan Kendrick was there today. Staff and a camper told Tristan about this week and how it helps kids manage their health. Having a camp experience is really important for all kids, but when you have diabetes, it can be challenging because you're needing to check your blood sugar. That's what Camp Medical Director Dr. Dan Schumer had to say about why Camp U Peninsula started years ago. Today is day two of the five-day annual camp hosting 36 type 1 diabetic boys and girls from the UP and other parts of the country. Camp Director Chris Alderton says Camp U Peninsula is all about educating campers about their condition. They're teaching themselves how to carb count, watch their blood sugars, look at their CGMs, they compare pumps, a whole wealth of different diabetic tips and hints that they share with each other. Alderton also says the majority of the campers were also here last year. Co-director Christy Ostermeyer says every camp morning starts at 7 o'clock with blood sugar checks. Ostermeyer says once all blood checks, breakfast, and chores are done, the fun begins. Activities such as field games, arts and crafts, there's a lot of swim time. So the rest of the day is, is just fun stuff for the kids. One first-year camper named Zoe Bradley says apart from all the fun activities like swimming, she's loved the camp so far because she can connect and communicate with kids that are just like her. We just do everything together in a group. We get to sleep together, we get to eat together, we get to talk together, and it's just really awesome. And I got put in a group with really amazing girls and so we have a lot of fun together. All camp staff say they want to thank all the donors that made it possible for this camp to only charge $20 per camper. Staff also say the hardest part will be Saturday when they have to say goodbye. Tristan Kendrick, TV6 News, Hiawatha Township.